we have to find the radius of convergence of this power series radius of convergence is defined as r equals to 1 upon limit n tends to infinity u n raised to the power 1 upon n in this problem u n is bracket 1 plus 1 upon n and so on up to 1 plus n upon n this is your u n so first we will find limit of u n raised to the power 1 upon n so limit n tending to infinity u n is 1 plus 1 upon n and so on up to 1 plus n upon n raised to the power 1 upon n because these are in product and logarithm functions play an important role product can be resolved in sum or sum can be resolved in product sometimes uh, typical types of product we can easily find out using logarithm function so i take log both side so log l equals to limit n tending to infinity log 1 plus 1 upon n or you can take 1 upon n this one outside 1 upon n finally and plus log 1 plus 2 upon n and so on log 1 plus n upon n finally we have this one because this is finite sum so i can use concept of riemann sum limit n tending to infinity 1 upon n and this is summation r running from 1 to n log 1 plus r upon n this is by riemann sum and uh, using riemann sum i can use definite integral as a riemann sum limit n tending to sorry this one i will write as 0 to 1 log 1 plus x dx and apply integration by parts so log l in the right left hand side left hand side and in the right hand side we will get x log x and limits from 0 to 1 minus 0 to 1 x upon 1 plus x dx to find this one we can consider 1 plus x as t from this dx equals to dt and x equals to t minus 1 and lim new limits of t is 1 to 1, 1 to 2 or you can use old limit but keep remember when you already put it for funks for values expression for x so finally log l equals to this one gives you log 2 minus 1 minus 1 upon t dt and integration and you can put a limit after some times so log to log to minus t minus log t and limits lower limit and upper limit this one equals to log to minus t is 1 plus x minus log 1 plus x now this is expression in terms of x so you can use limit of x instead of limit of t and after putting lower and upper limit what we have log 2 minus 2 plus log 2 my uh, plus 1 after simplifying we have 2 log 2 minus log e because log e is 1 so this is the value of l log l so l equals to 4 upon e but we have to evaluate r equals to 1 upon l so this one equals to e upon 4 now which one option is giving you e upon 4 option a will be right one 